Hello to everyone, today I'll change the backlights on the monitor. For this get out the old ones, insert new ones into their case and the monitor and get the working backlights breaking the matrix. Here are our new lamps. I'll put them at the top of the monitor. These two upper lamps died from it. I realized about this in the previous video. Look at a few moments and I'll leave you a link to the video. I took it apart, repaired the power supply, then turned it on and realized that the lamps didn't light and went on to replace them. Let's go ahead. And so here are the lamps. Let's connect them first and check. As you can see two lamps are on. Everything is fine. Well, let's start disassembling the model and replace two lamps. So after a second, everything has already been sorted out in separate parts. This is our matrix, here's the backlight and this matrix frame. All the frames are just snaps. At the end of the video you will see, nothing complicated. Next disassemble the backlight. Remove it by removing this iron cover from it. And we have two of our hack lights, the upper and lower. The rear bottom looks like this, fully operational. And the top one, as you can see, here at the beginning of the lamp burn it out. So the lamps didn't turn on. Well, let's start the replacement. While we have single lamps, they will have to be taken out of the housing. Therefore, we disassemble them and do it very carefully. They are very fragile. To begin with, we cut the adhesive tape with a scalpel and take out the wire that goes along the body. It is glued, realize it. Further, the lamps are in gums which are fixed in the body. Remove them by folding the latches on the iron frame. Bend the latches and extend the gums. And this is how the lamp is. In our hands. Slowly, carefully, but successfully. Now, as I turned out, you have to change the gums. Because with these gums, lamps don't fit into our case. Therefore, you have to change to double gums that stand in a broken lamps. To do this, cut a long wire, remove the single gums and double gums remove by cutting them to the side and then insert new lamps into these incisions. So the first lamp was inserted into the case and now begin to disassemble the second lamp. Also repeat everything, cut off the adhesive tape Cut off the wire and take out the lamp and set it in, in the second place in gums. So here I have two lamps in the old case. It looks like this. Solder back to wires and test. Now let's plug it in. And check if I messed up anything when installed in a new case. We connect to such a power supply with two outputs and turn on the power. The lamps are working fine, so you can install them in our backlights. This assembly you didn't watch, watch the assembly. Install two lamps in the black backlight frame. Then we take the lid. Cover and snap all the latch carefully in a circle. As you can see, there is nothing complicated about this. Next, take the matrix and put it as accurately as possible around all the edge. Once again I will say, as carefully as possible. I didn't do this, I put and put on the frame. I leveled it, then closed it with an iron frame. And it is also all on ledge. I'll tell you right away. If the ledge don't snap easily, it's not worth pushing them. It's better to remove and double check everything it is placed and not to crush everything by force, as I did. Then fasten the screws of the matrix board.
connect the cable and glue the protective tape back. Well, it's time to check how much I have successfully assembled everything. For this, take the bracket with the boards, connect all the cables and wires back. Connect the lamps and turn on. And what we see? F*** it up. It burst. The matrix is damaged. This is what I was talking about. Not surprisingly, when you push with all your might, some idiot broke the monitor. Well, as the main purpose of the repair was to fix it backlights. And I fixed it. Let's try to shift the picture a bit, like it was moved. But of course I didn't reach the edge. The clock is not completely visible. Ok, let's leave it, as it may. Maybe I can use it somewhere in handy. By the way, it's been in my work for about a year and works perfectly. For the repairing, put like. And also don't forget to watch my other videos and click on the circle in the center of the screen and subscribe to the Art Bell channel.